Saturday the tides at low tides are like two thirty or two or something. So, um, but yeah, the problem is I'm going away to Spain like, at five in the morning on Sunday, and I'm meant to be going camping with the family on Friday night in the new forest. So, um, sounds like you got problems. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the chances of squeezing and going around the aisle right between those two things are uh, slim to none, really. As far as preparation goes, it's been minimal. Let's go! I don't think you're ever ready for something like this. He's exhausted already. I like the goodness that was an absolutely petrifying conversation with Sam Light right then he is thinking and calling to wing around the Isle of Wight tomorrow I mean I'm gonna have to join him if that's the case it's looking like a really good forecast um, we haven't tried to wing around the Isle of Wight until the last time we tried to wing around the Isle of Wight Man, that was incredibly hard in the end. Uh, you know, like the boys actually called that the forecast was probably going to be a bit too light, and for all of us to to go around, it probably it was in the end. But uh, like, I managed to complete it just about. Just uh, it was a real big hard effort, and I can't put it into words quite yet. But uh, it was painful and long and frustrating. I didn't get anywhere near finishing it, but I feel that if we do it solo, unassisted, with no safety, there's just that much more on the line, so it will spur us to get this thing polished off. There's a fastest time up to beat. And just like that. I've literally just got here, got into my wetsuit, and I'm gonna swim out to the boat. That's it, we're pretty much ready, eh? Just make sure I've got everything. Bolt checker. There we go. Step one, wade to the boat. It's the tea, mate. The morning tea oh, delivery. Oh, and you got my bag keys as well, yeah? Right, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> hey, here we are. I know. Here we are. It's getting more real by the second. We've decided to start the Isle of Wight wing rounding attempt from Bembridge so that we can do the whole Solon this morning for the tidal gate for the needles and then uh, round the needles and do the whole downwind south side of the island um, in one hit and then arrive back here. Nice and early in Bembridge, straight to the boat for a nice warm cup of tea. That's the plan anyway. As far as preparation goes, it's been minimal. We only talked about this last night. Um, good breakfast, good sleep. Nice cup of tea, pretty much ready to go. Gonna stay with Sammy as long as possible, and yeah, fingers crossed. Island rounding, take two on the wing foils. Let's go. Let's go! <laughs> Woo! I don't think you're ever ready for something like this. Ready for a shreddy. Okay, 
and we are off. Gonna start by going around the fort and then go. Right, there's the fort. Bramford Fort. Okay, we are in. Okay, let's send it then. Okay, there we go. I'm off, I'm a little bit. I've been frightened of Sammy, but I'm gonna go for it. The Benbridge Fort is the marker for the start, and then we're gonna come back in here at the end. Weather is currently minging, but we're off to a good start. Really comfy. Five meter perfect. The day just off cows now. Sammy's catching up with me. I had a bit of a faster start, but now we're getting into the thick of it. Tides racing. We managed to get from Benbridge to cows in one tack, but now the beat begins up to the needles. Hard. in the full flood tide. Wow, dude. Okay. Hearst Castle rest stop. Quick Kit Kat. A few drinks of water. Onto the needles rounding. Bloody exhausted already. Half the island almost done. Not sure how this is gonna go. Right, we've hit the needles of flat tide. Just about. We're gonna get the road we got now! Woo! Catherine's point is gnarly. Didn't even get the camera out because it's so gnarly. I can see Benbridge! Benbridge up ahead! Oh my goodness! Whew. Benbridge marker boy! Good boy! Pretty Oh, there's a brand for dry spot! Oh my god, dude! 
and it's really shiny here. Uh, just as I get back into the harbour, that's a weed pit. Never have I been so happy to get my feet on land, nearly. Wow, that was uh, all manner of uh, hypnotic out there. I don't know how many hours that was, but that was a lot of winging. By far the most winging I have ever done. But we did it, that is an island rounding complete on the wing foils. Uh, so stoked to do it with Sammy. We tried last year and it didn't happen and it's good just to pick a last minute forecast and send it and uh, wow, to have it done and in the bag is a good feeling. Looking forward to getting back into that boat for a cup of tea now. That is for sure. Still a long way to walk. Oh my god, mate. Oh. <laughs> I don't have my camera. I'm gonna that. Thank you. That is a sweet taste of success. <laughs>